Hi everyone, hope that you are well. Uh, today I want to show you how we can do a cutout uh, into the walls. For example, um, I will do the cutout for the entrance and exit path of the of the of the cars. As you can see it here, we have the yeah we have the wall, and this will represent actually we need to cut out here uh, because the cars are exiting from the indoor parking. And on the other side, opposite, we have an entrance of the car into the parking. Uh, so here, definitely, uh, we need to do a cutout of this and have a better uh, representing. And in the second step, I want to show uh, how we can duplicate uh, the existing store um, or um, level, because this parking has uh, three floors. So if you want to, you know, duplicate, it's much easier um, just to use the, the features which are embedded in the dialogues. And then you just realize one single time the lighting design for the for your application, if it's a park, if it's an office or any other um, uh, building, and then you just duplicate the, uh, the lighting design, which can be applied also for... Uh, for uh, second floor. Okay, let's start with a uh, with a cutout. Um, so here, I will just you need to go on the cutouts. Here you have three possibility: rectangular cutout, circular, or polygonal. Um, I will just for I will go for a rectangular one. I will just yeah just use a simple one in this case. I will just go roughly this case. Let's make it as straight as possible. And then you just need to go, yeah. Floor level. And yeah, here it's the, the cutout. If you want to see how it looks, you just need to, for example, you go on the different setup and here it's uh, it's easy. You can see uh, actually the, the cutout. If you want to go back, just to adjust the dimensions of this cutout, uh, you go back on the screen and then just click on it. Uh, for example, you want to put on the floor, on the ground floor, one, or you want to change to, let's say, 30 meters, the dimension, or you want to put the height 2.3. Yeah, it's easy. It's easy to do it or 3.50. Yeah, that will do. So here is the, the cutout on this side. So now we just realized the, the cutout for the exit path of the cars. And we need one more for the entrance. So I'll just go once again. I will just use the rectangular one. Up, down, and I, you can just go easily this way. And here we go. That's it. And here it's too high. I will say. And then we can we can move it on the ground. And here, for example, you can make it also let's say two meters. Actually, this is this is the height, and the the other way around, yeah, two point four, and this one I will go the width. I think it's even bigger. It's around three meters. So let's go three meters. Yeah. So in this case, we have the the cutout on on the entrance. So I think that's quite easy. I hope that uh, you find useful this information. If you do not know how to do it, then it's um, it's easy to do it. Of course, this is the ground floor, so only here actually we will need the cutout. So to duplicate, it's better to duplicate the, the existing ground floor and then do the cutout because on the first floor, you will not have these, these cutouts. But nevertheless, now I will just, um, I want to show you how you can duplicate. So you just need to go ground floor and then you go on this. 
and then you just um, you go on the story and building construction and then duplicate story so now we have the ground floor and if you want for example walls and in here we know cutouts so here I can just take the cutouts out because I don't want to have will, I will not have cutouts on the first floor and then you just um, click duplicate and I hope that it will work will not have any problems in uh, duplicating the, the floor and let's see we should have yeah we should rename it we see that we have the duplication so this will be actually the the first floor on the building we can see actually the the ground floor which we have it here and then we have the the first floor and here so be first floor oh, sorry for mistyping yeah so now we have all the building with the site included so this is the indoor parking of course you have you have another floor it's just yeah you need to just copy so the indoor parking uh, that's that's all so please subscribe to my channel if you find inform this information useful for you um in the next video i would move to let's say um i will start with uh, working on the outdoor uh, parts of this parking as you can see here we have some uh, outdoor parking so i will start to do import uh, exterior surfaces what we work with uh, exterior surfaces here we have a green area with trees we have a ramp which is going on the terrace of this uh, the parking and yeah remain tuned for uh, for the next videos and give a like to this video and don't for for, uh, don't uh, forget to subscribe to my channel and until next time i wish you all the best have a good day bye bye